a couple Could of be. doom. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Irmo Yellow Jackets red hot after losing their second game of the year to Eau Claire. The Jackets ran off a string of 25 straight. Didn't lose a single game at home. Tonight rolled into the state 4A semifinals against Wando, feeling pretty good about themselves, feeling like they could pull off the repeat. Take care of the Warriors this evening, then wrap up a second straight state crown on Friday with a win at the Coliseum. So out to the Temple of Doom we go. All-American B.J. Mackey making his final appearance, looking for 33 straight at home. And who scores the first basket in the game? Who else? B.J. Mackey. 2 nothing. But it was Wando taking charge then off the great pass. Robert Gregg just lays it in. Then the Warriors in transition again. Chad German takes it straight to the hoop. Warriors up by six. Do I smell an upset? Something smells funky. How about a, a bank there? Banks were open. 20 to 10. Warriors lead, but Irmo rallies. Mackie skies for that one, then puts it up. Yellow Jackets up by five at the half, and then the All-American takes charge in the second half. He had 30, 16 from the foul line. He gave head coach Tim Whipple some reason to smile. With all the pressure they were putting on tonight, he just did a tremendous job of getting the ball and then getting it down the floor, and either he was converting or he was getting it to people to convert. So he just did a tremendous job, and, you know, that, what can you say about him? He's done everything. Now we'd like to bring home one more. So BJ and company will try to do it one more time. Their second straight 4A championship Friday night at the Coliseum against Hillcrest of Simpsonville, who just buried Lexington tonight, 61-37. In high school hoops, the Irmo Yellow Jackets are celebrating tonight after defeating Wando 71-59 to advance to Friday night's Quad A state championship final at Frank McGuire Arena. Irmo led the Warriors by five at halftime, but the team took control in the second half to post a 12-point victory. McDonald's All-American B.J. Mackey led the Yellow Jackets with 30 points. Irmo will put its 26-game winning streak on the line Friday against Hillcrest of Simpsonville, which defeated Lexington tonight. 61 to 37.